Now to new information we're learning into a crash involving a Detroit fire truck. Take a look here at the scene this morning at the intersection of Dickerson and Houston Whittier on the city's east side. Four firefighters and two people in the other car were injured. Victor Williams has an update on their conditions. Thankfully, everyone is expected to be OK. The fire department right down the street with the crew responding to another fire. Unfortunately, this is the aftermath of what took place. You can see the tire marks from where this fire truck had to be pulled out. The person inside there is saying she's lucky to be alive because it almost hit her home. I was on the phone talking to my sister and I heard this loud crash. I looked out the window and saw the fireman laying on the pavement. The major accident between a fire truck and SUV taking place right in Loretta Sanders' yard around 8 a.m. Wednesday morning, barely missing her house. Tore my garbage can. I couldn't figure out what that was to hit. Four firefighters were inside the truck. Two were injured, along with the two inside the SUV. Neighbor Diane Longmire says it was a possibility that a minor was inside the vehicle. It was a young, um, probably a teenage son size that they took away as well as the driver. The circumstances behind the crash are still under investigation while sirens and lights were believed to be on. We're told, however, many accidents have happened at the intersection of Dickerson and Houston Whittier. It's always something with this, this intersection. We always have them crash into somebody in this intersection. Fire truck is going to be okay. The vehicle, however, that SUV, not so much with it looking like a total loss. Victor Williams, local. Okay, Victor, thanks.